So that's all the traveling I've done. You done any traveling recently, Raleigh Mao? Raleigh. Yes, sir. Have you um, done any traveling recently, brother? Uh, no, I'm, I'm about to. Okay, great. And where are you headed, bud? I'm going to Denver. Oh, okay, buddy. Wow. And how do you do at altitude? How do, how do, um, I don't know how to say this. How do, are you, do a lot of, uh, how do Asians do at altitude? Uh, I, I think we do, I think we do good. Okay. What are some famous high altitude Asians? Are there any? I'm trying to think of one. Because if I think of a mountain, brother, I don't always think of, um, and maybe this is racist. I mean, I don't think of an Asian on a mountain. Is that? Um, yeah, so I looked it up. It says Tibetans and Sherpa are the only two present day high altitude East Asian ethnic groups. Tibetans, damn. I thought, I thought, damn, Tibetans. Are you sh- Tibetan? Wow. And those are high altitude Asians, huh? Correct. Gosh, boy, some Red Bull drinkers, baby. They're getting up there. And what else has been going on in your life, brother? Um, nothing much. Um, a good friend of mine passed. No. Yeah. Oh man. But I'm sorry, man. Um and was it a uh was it a male or female? Uh female. Oh. God, that's wild. Usually, I feel like men die more. I don't feel like I hear a lot about women dying. You know? Oh, I'm sorry, man. Were you able to go to a service or anything? Or what do you guys do for that sort of thing? Yeah, we had a uh, a good uh, celebration of life on Saturday. Oh. And was there food or not? There was, yeah. Mm. What would they have? They had uh, tacos. Oh. That's interesting. I feel like you don't see a lot of, um, ta- you know, a lot of, I, I, I feel like you don't see a lot of, like, kind of tacos when there is uh, decease or death, you know? Dang. That's f- surprising. Were you surprised at that? Um, Not really. She She really liked tacos. Oh, man. We're going to check back in with you. You know, I know we haven't seen each other in a while, and I see you got that facial hair going. Maybe you got that catfish rocking, huh, Daddy? I do. How do you feel about that? What what spurned that? Uh, I just wanted to try something new. Mm. And do you feel different with it? Does it feel, how does that feel, you know? Because I rock it, you know? Yeah, no, it feels great. It feels definitely uh, very different. Like how? Like, do you feel, give me five words that makes you feel some, you know, give me some words. I feel older. Okay, older. Grown. Grown, okay. So black and older. Um, I don't know, I look better maybe. I, mm, that's hold on, that's a lot of what you get. Don't just do, you just have to do a word. Sorry. But I have to have the rules for the little thing, for the game. You want to think about them? Yeah, I'll think about them. Okay. What else? Riley, I'm sure people are going to want to know. We usually get an update on how your dating life is going. What's going on there, bub? Uh, still, still nothing. Really? Okay, that's okay. Well, damn, dude. And, and, and how's everything going? I know we talked in the past about the masturbatory efforts and stuff. You've been out there glazing that glizzy, homie. What's been going on? You've been freaking burping that little pants yurt or what? Um, You've been frisbeeing that little syrup dog or what? Uh, still nothing. Oh, man. You tell Riley Mal, people are not believing this, man, that you've never, you still have never ejaculated. Is that true? Yeah, it's true. Gosh, Never brother, we got to get you on a damn pay-per-view. I mean, you could open up for Logan Paul and Dylan Danis. You could be in an early preliminary. I mean, there's never in your life. You telling me the truth, Riley. I am. 
Never, not even in your sleep. God has never come and touched you in your sleep. Never. What? Oh, my God. We could raffle you off to a bunch of older gay men in Hollywood. They, bro, they pay half a million dollars for you in Hollywood to be getting clean sauce out of a damn Vietnamese fella from the mountains. Yeah, um, I'm, I'm actually not Vietnamese. Well, but yeah, but you know what I'm, or what are you? I'm uh, Japanese, Korean, Hawaiian, and Norwegian. Well, you know, that's pretty much Vietnamese, dude. But that doesn't matter, man. What matters is we're both human beings, baby boy. And I can't believe, boy, you got that clean syrup in you, son. You got that 6,000 octane, boy. Gosh. That's God's gleek, homie. You That thing coming right off the clouds of the Lord. My God. Dude, if you you if you got you a little, if you got you a half ounce of that and you uh painted the toes of some of these gay men and perverted men out there in Hollywood. My God. Oh, but I'm sorry, that's not what we need to be doing. That's not what we need to be involved in, man. I'm sorry for saying that stuff. Oh, you're good. You know, but uh, do you worry about not being able to get an erection when you do get a woman, Riley? When you, because you, you're now you're saving yourself for marriage. That's correct. Correct. But how do you know your that your body's going to work then? Uh, I I just believe it will when the time comes. Hey boy! Wow, bro, that is a risk, though, Riley. Look, I. But you know what, man? I've seen miracles happen, man. I really have. I've seen miracles happen, bro. And if you look, I would stand by y'all's bed and pray for y'all. Pray, you know, by y'all's marital bed or whatever. Be in the next room and, you know, put my hands on the wall and pray or whatever you needed, buddy. And what type of gal have you changed your stance on? What type of girl you're looking for? Like, say if you had to pick a word or something that, like, what would your gal kind of look like, you think? Or, or how is she? Or if you have some thoughts on her, what her heart is like or whatever. Um, I don't know. Um, blonde. Okay, okay, you like a blonde, okay. And if I tell you two names, like Bambi or, um, Rebecca, does one of those names sit better with you? What type of gal you're thinking? Uh, not really. Okay, either one. Now, Bambi, they die in the woods, you know what I'm saying? So you gotta keep that on tap, buddy, on your... You know, you got to, you ever done any door to door sales, Riley? I have. Really? Wonderful, man. What did you guys sell? Um, anything from popcorn to seized candy. Oh, wow. And how'd you get involved with that? You So you were doing more, um, is that called, uh, that's not really entrees. That's more side items, huh? Right. Okay. And what, uh, wait, how did you get involved with that? Uh, popcorn was for scouts and seized candy was for band. Ooh, ooh. And what was easier to pedal? Let me, what do you think was easier to pedal out there? What do you mean? Like a bike? No, no, no. What, do, what was easier to sell to folks? Oh, um, seized candy. Oh yeah. Why you think? Uh, I think everyone just liked candy more than popcorn. Yeah. Yeah, that's interesting. Yeah, I think if you put candy on the word of uh, on the back of anything, it's you know, people are interested in it. You know, you throw any you throw candy on the back of something, people are more excited. You know, anything else you want to say, Riley? Um, you know, just that you know, I'm glad that my family is safe. Um. My, I have some family out in Maui, um, some cousins out there that mm. they're both firefighters and, you know, I'm wow. just glad everyone's safe. Really? Huh? Firefighters. So were they, did, were they, they, they must've been involved, huh? Yes. Uh, they all lost their homes. Oh man. Oh Man, the world, the sometimes there's just so much going on. It feels just, it feels just really, it feels like a lot, doesn't it? Yeah, definitely. 
well, I'm sorry, brother. I'm sorry that that happened for them. And, you know, that, that, that community over there, God, there is nothing more special if you get to witness it in your life. Um, I'm sorry that that happened, but thank you for letting us know that, Riley. Let, you know, let us know a little bit more about you, you know. And that's important. And if we ever get that boner to launch, homie, we might have to get a couple firemen to put that thing out, boy. Whoo, boy. We're going to get that branch to burn. Hope you enjoyed that video. And you can watch another. And you can watch this one. You can watch this one. Different options, different choices. Some guy just brings you one option, not this guy. Two options. Watch one. This one or this one.